is Buddy Ricker. We are with Little Fish Improv. This is yeah. So let's get our uh, group up here. We're going to get started here. Um, again, we are Little Fish Improv. So what I'd like to do is uh, uh, we get these actors. It's their first show, so we got to build them up. All right. So we're going to do what we call a little clap down. All right. So we're going to start with the golf clap. All right. Okay. And then we're going to go to like a little league clap, a little bit more. All right. And then we're going to go to, okay, now we're in a uh, high school basketball game. And now we're in a football game. No, no, no. European soccer match, ladies and So good. we're going to practice a little bit. Can we get the house lights up at all? Is anyone up there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Woo! <laughs> She's running up there. Okay, so yeah, just the house lights up just real quick. So like, okay, so what's going to happen is I'm going to shout out a question. You guys just shout the first thing that comes to your, to your mind, all right? So uh, we're going to practice, all right? So I'll, I'll hear the suggestions. I'll take the best one or the one that I want. All right, so let's, let's practice here. Uh, what is your first name? Jeff! Yeah. You guys all got it right. And now, yeah, that was your first name. I'm oh, sorry. A little late, Brian. And then, uh, what is your favorite um, uh, movie? Your mom! Star Wars! Oh, Someone say your mom? Oh, my God. <laughs> that was a weird time to say. What kind of a movie is that? All right, we're going to get started here. Our first game that we're going to do is called What Are You Doing? Can I get uh, two members out on the stage out here? What you doing? And Sam's going to answer with anything other than what he's actually doing. English class. All right. So then uh, now uh, Kevin is going to do English class. And then Sam is going to ask him. Kevin, what are you doing? And Kevin's going to answer with anything other than what he's actually doing. Calculating the square root of Shakespeare. <laughs> All right. So that's the gist of the game. We'll go back and forth. But let's make it a little bit harder. Someone give me a letter in the alphabet. <laughs> B, I heard B. All right, so the first word that they say has to start with the letter B. If they don't, I blow my whistle and they are eliminated from the game, not in life. <laughs> so B is your scene idea. What are you doing is your game. Actors, are you ready? Yes. 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 And again. Hey, Sam. What you doing? Busting moves. <laughs> Uh, Kevin, what are you doing? Being buddy. Ooh. 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 <laughs> hey, 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 everybody, I'm, 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 I'm sorry, I dropped that. <laughs> hey, Sam, yeah. what are you doing? Being so kind to buddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can I get you something to drink? Uh, food. Not kind enough. All right. Uh, <laughs> Let's get another letter. Give me another letter of the alphabet. L. L is your, L is your uh, scene idea or your, your name. Go ahead. Or your letter. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, Sam, what are you doing? Lifting cars. <laughs> Chase the tire! Ah! What are you doing? Loving enthusiastically. <laughs> What can I say? <laughs> okay. Sam, what are you doing? I'm, oh, yep. <laughs> He said I'm, he said I'm, all right. I said I'm. All right, let's get another letter. Q. Q. Q is your scene idea. <laughs> Q, what are 
you doing? Crunching my thirst! There we go. Uh, boy, I sure do love a nice glass of lemonade on a hot day. <laughs> Alex, what are you doing? Um... Uh, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna make it a little bit harder now. I need two letters. Give me that first letter. Yeah. Z. Z. Oh. And the second letter. Yeah. Y. Z Y. First word starts with Z. Second word has to start with Y. What's it gonna be? Z. Is it Z? Oh, yeah. I'm I sorry. Z. Yeah. Z and Y. And they're probably asking why, but I don't know. This is the first two I heard. That's right. Z and Y. Hey, Kiara, what are you doing? Zebra yarn knitting. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Andy, what are you doing? Zipping yellow. Yellow. It's yellow. <laughs> it's acrobats. <laughs> Hey, Kiara, what you doing? Zoo yodeling. Zen. It's about not elevating your spirit, but finding equilibrium between yourself and the universe. 
<laughs> As we come from the Tao, we are of the Tao. I have a question. Yes. Um, I'm having trouble getting to Zen. Yes. Um, how do I do that? You must find equilibrium between yourself and the universe. So, if I, like... <laughs> that, that's yoga. Oh! Oh! There's a difference? There is. Okay. The Tao which can be named is not the true Tao. Can I borrow your back? Yes. Thank you! <sighs> that's much better. A little lower. Okay. <laughs> yes. A little lower. Feeling great. That's Zen. To find Zen, you must have equilibrium between yourself and the universe. I have a question. Yes. I can't find Zen. <laughs> to find Zen, you must have equilibrium between yourself. So, like this? Th that's yoga. Oh, crap. Uh, they're the same. Okay, I thought they were different things. The Tao, Wait. which can be named. Yes. Thank you. A little oh. lower. Finding equilibrium between yourself and the universe. I have a question. Yes. I can't find Zen. That's not Zen. Is this it? No. 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 I thought it was different. Cannot be spoken. If it's spoken, it's not the true tell. Yes. A yeah. little Thanks. lower. This is much better. That's Zen. Bicycles. Kind of a lot to choose from, isn't it? Many, many bicycles. No. Oh. <laughs> All right, so Alex said the wrong letter, so now we're going to have someone come in, and now Kevin's going to say his last line, and I'll start the clock again. Kind of a lot to choose from, isn't it? A lot, a lot, a lot of. You got it. <laughs> Maybe say that a little slower? 
No. <laughs> I'll go on. Please, I do not want to. I have been repeating myself all day. Oh, uh, quite likely, Mr. Orlando. Like really? That's what you have to say to me? Sure. <laughs> Too much. This is too much. I let you into my bicycle store and you just, just, you're problematic. Under no circumstances did I mean to offend <laughs> Very likely that is true, but do I interpret it that way? No, of course not. Well, of course not. <laughs> oh. Xylophone! <laughs> you have xylophones as well! <laughs> Zen masters are really good at xylophones. Listen. Uh, been there, done that. Can't say that I ever have. Didn't you? Every now and then. Finding Nemo is so hard. Get over it. I don't know. Choking! Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, we're going to get another scene idea. So give me a uh, winter Olympic sport. Bob sledding. The scene idea is going to be based on Bob sledding. Uh, but now we're going to go, uh, uh, we're going to skip a letter in the alphabet. So uh, give me a letter to start with. <laughs> Start with P, skip the letter. Uh, we'll try to get through the alphabet on that. So P is your letter, Bob Fletting is your idea, actors, are you ready? Yes! And go. Pile on in. Ready to go! <laughs> Two, one, go! Violent, it's so violent! <laughs> I get up. We're gonna crash! <laughs> yes, We're gonna flip! I lost it. Alright. Say your last line, Brian. Forget that! We're gonna flip! Help! <laughs> just, just, just hold me. Let's <laughs> <Nice time. laughs> hug. Okay, not now. Oh. Alright, so for this game what's going to happen is we've got our, uh, we're going to have our hero in there 
later, and they're going to, uh, we're going to have to name them. So give me a superhero you've never heard of that's kind of a name. What is it? Flyman. Flyman? Flyman. Flyman. Flyman is going to be your uh, hero. So who's the, who's the person on here? All right, and you'll be a uh, person on here. These guys are off, off stage. So Flyman, and he's going to have, he's going to see on his big uh, screen a uh, problem. Give me something that goes on in everyday life that's kind of annoying. The milk's not there, we're out of milk. So the whole world is out of milk. So these four superheroes have to handle that, all right? And uh, Andy's going to name the superheroes as they come in, or uh, one at a time, and they're going to try to see if they can solve this problem. No milk, there's no milk in the world. Actors, are you ready? Yes! All right, fly guy, fly man. And begin. I could use a big old glass of milk right now. <laughs> There's no milk. This is a job for Flyman. <laughs> I'm Flyman. I'm the world's famous Flyman, and I'm here to solve the problem because I was going to get some milk out of the fridge, and there's nothing there. I don't know how we're going to solve this problem, but I could use a little help, I think, from my friends here, because I don't know. I think this is a job to figure out how to get the milk. Uh, this is a job for Ladybug Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Ladybug Boy. Did Lady somebody call for Ladybug Boy? Uh, Ladybug Boy. <laughs> Oh, together, ladybug boys. Thank you. There we go. Much. We got it the second time. We got a problem here. I know there's no milk. I actually called the commissioner. He said that, that we got a problem because there's no milk in the whole world. The whole and world. And you need to fix it right away, fly boy. You're fly boy. I, I'm ladybug. Man. Yes. You are. <laughs> ladybug boy. Fix it, ladybug yes, boy. Of course. Uh, so, I think what we need to do is, there's been a very uh, noticeable lack of bugs flying around cows. And as you know, bugs are the things that get the cows to produce milk. So, using my powers as Lady Bug Boy, Lady Bug Boy, Lady Bug Boy <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Hmm, perhaps this is a job for Broken Payphone Boy. Ah, broken Payphone! <laughs> yes. Oh, there he is. <laughs> broken pay. Oh, right. Sorry, the wasn't working. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, we have a predicament. All of the milk in the world is kaput. Completely. Yes. Completely? And Lady Bug Boy, right? Yes. Couldn't figure it out. And I'm, what was my name again? Fly Boy. Fly Boy. I couldn't figure it out either. We need to get milk right away because babies are starving all over the world. All over the world. All over, all over the world. world. Well, I'll just make a call and we can fix that. <laughs> this is not going to work quite as well as it but... Let me try that one. Right. You sure don't have a lot of payphones around here, right? <laughs> nope, that's not gonna work either. Um, all right, so, if milk... What, what did you try doing again? You tried what? milking bugs. That's Which never gonna work. Why can't you a phone call? Um, I think what we really need is Ice Cream Lass to help us out. Oh. Hey, Ice Cream Lass! You called? Yes, yes. Well, I didn't actually, as it turns out, the phone call. <laughs> Directly, and here you are! With a happy little jingle! Yeah, we have a problem. Oh. Uh, there is no milk. Oh. Okay, we have two problems. I'm, I'm so sorry, I'm attracted to ice cream. Oh. Okay, don't look at Don't let's get let's get ourselves let's together. together. All right. So, so ice cream last, there is a shortage of milk. Flyboy can't fix it, and we can't milk the bugs. Do you have any ideas? <laughs> Yet. I've got it. I'll take all of my pre-made ice cream and I'll put it back through the distillery and it'll now just be cream and milk and ice and salt for some reason. <laughs> you say distillery? 
Yes, it, it understood. It's an ice cream distillery. But I, I'll need your bug's help because I use bug workers. Oh, Don't yeah. tell the, the FDA. <laughs> I'll call it to, I'll call it to me, Thank you. No, I won't. Oh, it's okay. I think it's this is right. enough bugs. Okay, yes. here we go. I got the contraptions, and I'll do the happy little jingle while you guys do the work. Okay, <laughs> of course. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Yes. Oh, wow, that's a lot of milk. And to from that, made. we can have it mate. <laughs> it's going to make baby milk. <laughs> oh, I hear another ice cream truck. That sounds like my friend Chad. I got to go. <laughs> so, the ice cream mask did make some mention of mating. Yes. Bugs. Human, I'm out of here. Bye. <laughs> oh, <laughs> if you look at the time, I do happen to have a date. <laughs> I'm, uh, I won't see you later. <laughs> this has been brought to you by the letters A. <laughs> For you. Do you know what that surprise is? I'm afraid to say. I think you are. But, Terry, would you come out? <gasps> My God! Terry the Talking Carrot! Whoa! When it's medium size, it stays medium size. <laughs> it's a flashback. <laughs> Henry, go out and dig up a carrot, okay? Okay. Thank you. I'll need two of them. I'm making carrot cake. 
two of them. Yes. Well, I'm a younger porcupine at this point, so to me, a medium-sized carrot sure would seem like a regular full-sized carrot. It's an innocent mistake. <laughs> Talk show, Henry felt ambushed and felt he could no longer trust the main uh, person that he cared about the most, which was the talk show host, <laughs> who was oddly his uncle. <laughs> now, his uncle had started the talk show primarily because of witnessing the relationship between Henry and Terry. <laughs> Screaming, I didn't think I did anything wrong, and now it's attacking me. Ah! <laughs> Ter Terry, 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 I need you to step over here. Henry, what did you do? I didn't do anything. I thought because I am. <laughs> That's the right reaction to a threat like that coming from adults. <laughs> All right. Finish up, guys. And his uncle, realizing his mistake, quickly apologized. And they all began a crusade against the toxic reality show media that, uh, that, that, that uh, mm, was, really, was a really bad thing. That show me! We're all joined together now. No more talk shows! No more talk shows! You no know what I think I'll shows. do? I'll start a talk show that's different than the other talk shows. Slumber. Oh, concubine, thank you. <laughs> With my cowl, I am ready to become not a monster sleeping in my grave, but the Count. <laughs> my unsuspecting guest is here, concubine. How did you get them? Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. That sounds very interesting. <laughs> and now, to my unsuspecting dinner guest. <laughs> Good evening. <laughs> and thank you for joining. May I have many business dealings to take care of tonight. <laughs> My assistant will go through the details. <laughs> Good 
my slumber. Ah, my concubine, you have my cowl. Now I shall become not a monster sleeping in his grave, but the Count. He's so handsome. <laughs> Is my dinner guest ready for me? What? How did you retrieve them? I, mm -hmm. <laughs> when he said he wanted me for dinner, I mean, I thought it was like a date. <laughs> so, Occupying, though. Very interesting. <laughs> and now I go to meet my dinner date. <laughs> Good evening. <laughs> and welcome to my castle. Oh, thanks. We have many business dealings to go over. My assistant will talk through the details. Ah, <laughs> uh, you're the assistant? Okay, I want a marriage by next week. Now, don't tell him this. I am expecting. All right, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Sam is going to do the exact thing. Kiara's going to do her exact thing. And the final person is going to let us, uh, who's going to tie it all together. And that is Kevin. So on the count of three, let's say, hey, Kevin, okay? One, two, three. Hey, Kevin! Notice we didn't say we need an actor when we saw you. <laughs> I awaken from my slumber. Ah, thank you, Baron. You have my cowl, thank you. Now I become not a monster sleeping in his grave, but the Count. Can I stake you now? Is my dinner guest here? He's so handsome. Wow. I'm here. How did you retrieve them? I invited them for dinner, and they seemed mm -hmm. very keen to come over. He said like a date. <laughs> yep. That sounds very interesting. I offered them steak. Concubine, yes. Yeah. <laughs> and now I go. I have a dinner date. Ah, uh, isn't that what... good evening? Oh, hiya! Good to see you. Thank you for coming to my castle. We have many business dealings to go over. My assistant <laughs> will give you the details. This way, please. It sounds good. So we're having. Okay, so you're the assistant. Okay, I expect a marriage proposal for next week. <laughs> show that. Go ahead, Kevin. 185 pieces of furniture walk into a bar. The bartender says, eh, we don't serve furniture here. The furniture says, well, you ought to, man. Five cults? 
walked into the bar and the bartender says, <laughs> we don't serve cults here. <laughs> and the cults say, well, you got some Kool-Aid? <laughs> walk into a bar, the bartender says, ah, we don't serve cults here, and they say, you will. <laughs> 185 cults walk into the bar, the bartender says, we don't serve cults here. The cults say, well, back to the mothership. <laughs> 195 cults walk into a bar, the bartender says, hey, we don't serve cults here. The cults say, well, we came to recruit. <laughs> walk into a bar. The bartender says, we don't serve cults here. The cults say, but baby, it's cult outside. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get another now. Bears. What is it? Bears. Bears. Bears is yours to sing uh, your now. All right, so Alex has got to come up with one. Everyone else, all right. Got this. 185 bears walk into a bar. The bartender says, hey, we don't serve bears here. And they say, hey, that's a little grizzly of you. <laughs> 185 bears walk into a bar. The bartender says, we don't serve bears here. The bears say, hi, Brene, you got enough for us too. <laughs> 185 bears walk into a bar. The bartender says, we don't serve bears here. The bears say, why not? The bartender says, because you're bare naked. Oh. <laughs> 185 bears walk into a bar. Bartender says, we don't serve bears here. And the bears go, oh, for Pete's sake. <laughs> 185 bears walk into a bar. Bartender says, we don't serve bears here. The bears say, how about a white claw? Yeah. Oh. 185 bears walk into a bar. Bartender says, hey, we don't serve bears here. And the bears say, oh, we just want to buy a polar. Oh! All right, let's get another now. Spaceship. Spaceship. It's a lot like cults, but we'll do spaceship. Spaceship. Go ahead, Kira. 185 spaceships walk into a bar, and from those spaceships, we all walk the spacemen. The bartender says, We don't serve spaceships or spacemen. And both of them, they all say in unison as they walk out the door. Live long and prosper. Yeah. <laughs> 185 spaceships, they walk into a bar, and the bartender says, we don't serve spaceships here. And the spaceship says, I ain't smart to phone. <laughs> Five spaceships walk into a bar. The bartender says, "I'm sorry, we don't serve spaceships here." The spaceships say, "That's okay. I wanted a drink." <laughs> 185 spaceships walk into a bar. The bartender says, "We don't serve spaceships here." The spaceship says, "That's not very enterprise." <laughs> walk into a bar. The bartender says, we don't serve spaceships here. The spaceships say, oh, I just wanted some chips and chips. Hey. All right, we'll one more now. The Youth groups. There aren't a lot of rules for a family-friendly show. <laughs> Among them are no politics and no religion. <laughs> We've all, all right. Uh, You're up, buddy. 185 youth groups walk into a bar. Bartender says, I'm sorry, we don't serve youth groups here. And the youth groups say, it's okay, I just wanted a drink. 185 youth groups walk into a bar. Bartender says, hey, we don't serve youth groups here. Youth groups, flip around the chair, sit down and say, why don't we talk about that? Under 85 youth groups walk into a bar. Bartender says, hey, we don't serve youth groups here. The youth groups say, I'm just kidding around. Yeah. 185 youth groups drive into a bar. The bartender says, whoa, 
we do not serve youth groups. Youth groups look at one another and say, Jesus, take the wheel. <laughs> All right, give a hand, everyone. Hey, guys, it's so nice to see you. Thank you for uh, We'll see you guys back here in 10 minutes. Thank you very much for your little fish and pie. So they're challenging each other. So now, Reed has to do the exact same motion, but he's got to justify it differently. I'm going to guess that's what it was. I'm throwing a fishnet. Try that out for a second. Yes, all right. And they're going to go back and forth until one of them can't, and I'll blow the whistle and get someone else uh, out there. Go ahead. I'm multi-classing, so I'm throwing a discus. Try that on for size. <laughs> <laughs> Getting ready to throw the spear. Try that for a time. I'm unzipping the world's biggest zipper. Try that on for a I'm really obnoxiously slapping somebody. Try that on for <laughs> I am throwing a toddler. Try that on for <laughs> I'm not gonna top that. Try that on for a <laughs> sport that's not bobsledding. Uh, not the moon. Ice skating. Figure skating. Ice skating. All right. So now they're going to do an uh, action based on figure skating. Figure skating. Try that out for size. <laughs> I am going to go meet my true love. Try that out for size. <laughs> I'm singing in the rain. Try that out for size. <laughs> Garden ballet. Try that on Versailles. It's the Ministry of Silly Books. Try that on Versailles. I think there was a movie with Tom Hanks in it where they're playing on the piano. Try that on Versailles. I'm trying to fix a really bad wedgie. Try that on Versailles. I just learned my shoes are on the wrong feet. Try that on Versailles. I just figured my laces are tied together. Tied out of size. I am now in Dune and I can walk on sand. <laughs> That's what she 
said. I got it. Okay. I'll never let go, Jack. <laughs> you can't handle the truth. 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 You can't handle the You're so vain. Just the, um, um, oh, uh, you, don't you packed the tickets. You you packed the you tickets. Sure. Did you give them to somebody else again? You know, I, I don't know about the tickets, but you know what? You guys can't handle the truth. You're right. <laughs> That's right. I killed her. I killed her off because she was, wow, she was an evil woman. And I don't like her. Take me to prison right Objection. away. Objection. Objection. I want to drive a Zamboni! <laughs> but this is a train! Oh, never mind. <laughs> Me too, I'd like to drive a Zamboni. Yeah, but there's I... tickets for that as well. I need your tickets. Come on, come on, give me them. But I must say that... <laughs> oh. <laughs> I must say that... Hakuna Matata. <laughs> Oh, it's a lion. <laughs> this is your land. <laughs> you shall call it your land. Yes. All of this, Father? Yes, all of it. What about the really dark patch over in the corner there? <laughs> Everything except for... You talking to me? <laughs> Yes, I'm talking to you. I want to talk to you. Come here, over here. You. Yeah. Yeah. I'm talking to you because I'm too sexy for my shed. Kevin, I am going to need you to leave your shirt on, okay? Okay. Because you know why? Why? Move. 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 Okay. Move. Okay. I've got one thing to say, and it's uh, 
Pick up the phone and start dialing. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. Yeah. You don't say. Oh, party call. I, I love do this. Not. This is what Zoom used to be. <laughs> I have one Wait, thing to we did this one. <laughs> I have one thing to say. I am a golden god. That's what she said. Six, seven, eight. Met her on a Monday and her name was Pam. A do, do run, 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 do, do run, run. She sure was pretty, but she didn't like Sam. Do, do run, 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 do, do run, run, do, 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 yeah. She blew up like Bam. Do, 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 yeah. And she went on a tramp. Do, 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 yeah. So that she could get some spam. Do, do, do run, 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 do, do run, run. When she's halfway there, she realized she hit it ham. To do, do run, 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 to do run, run. And folk music really was her jam. To do run, 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 to do run, run, to do, 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 yeah. She had a test she needed to cram. Do, 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 yeah. And that. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. I met him on a Monday and his name was Zach. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? He liked to wear a lot of black. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? Did you do? Yeah. He had a hairy back. <laughs> he wanted to wear a sack. <laughs> yeah. His mother said, "There's a tack." Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? Really was busy, he was not on the right track. He's going on a trip, but he forgot to pack. He was going with his friend Jack. Yeah. But he also was learned to attack. Yeah. And his friend Jack went smack. Instead he took a flight to Mackinac. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Six, seven, eight. I met him on a Monday and his name was Chad. The do run, 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 the do run, run. His best friend was the Count and his name was Vlad. The do run, 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 the do run, run, the do, 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 yeah. He was really bad. The do, 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 yeah. He was kind of mad. The do, 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 yeah. But he was never sad. The do run, 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 the do run, run. Decided to take a trip to Islamabad. <laughs> yeah! 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 Yeah!
Who just said it? Joe. Joe. Who starts? Me. Oh, it starts. All right, here we go. All right. I met him on a Monday and his name was Joe. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? He had to get up early, but he's kind of slow. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? Did you, did you, yeah? He started by stubbing his toe. Did you, did you, yeah? And he scraped, ow, go! Did you, did you, yeah? And he called his friend Mo. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? When it came to travel, he didn't know where to go. <laughs> His brain didn't work really good. He was kind of a schmo. Yeah, that joke was kind of blow. Yeah, he's going out to mo. Yeah, no, I'm far too slow. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? He went out to mo. Snow. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? He thought about moving to Idaho. Yeah, because he loved a potato. <laughs> yeah, and he loved to sew. <laughs> yeah, he also loved to sew with an E. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. Met him on a Monday and his name was Clay. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? He really, he liked to play. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? Did you, did you, yeah? He thought, I've got to get away. Did you, did you, yeah? But which way? Did you, did you, yeah? He thought, maybe I'll stay. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? He comes from religion and he started to pray. Did you run, run, run? Did you run, run? What's a ray? <laughs> yeah. In math, he was only okay. <laughs> yeah. So he just Googled it and said, I don't care anyway. <laughs> going on that trip, you're gonna do it in May. Did you run, 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 did you run, run? But he also had chickens who liked to lay. Did you run, 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 did you run, run, run? Did you, did you, yeah. He moved to Seagull Bay. Did you, yeah. To have fish filet. <laughs> yeah. And he said, hooray. <laughs> of that before, but looks like a, a casket to me. Reverse. Looks like a <clears throat> casket to me. Uh, Mr. Lamb, I've never seen anything like that before. What's going on? What's this? Forward. What's going on? What's this? Uh, Mr. Lamb, I've never seen anything like that before. Looks like a <clears throat> casket to me. That is the shrine of Anubis. <laughs> that is the shrine of Anubis. It looks like a uh, casket to me. You know... <laughs> you know my name. Mr. Lamb, <laughs> I have something to show you. Hey, what's up? What's this? Hey, what's up? What's this? You know, Mr. Lamb... Oh, good, you know my name. <laughs> it looks like a uh, casket. 
casket to me. This is the shrine of Anubis. Reverse. This is the shrine of Anubis. Forward. This is the shrine of Anubis. Reverse. This is the shrine of Anubis. Looks like a poop casket. I don't know my name. Mr. Lamb, got something to show you. What is this? What's going on? Forward. What's this? What's going on? Mr. Lamb, I got something to show you. Okay, you know my name. <laughs> Looks like a casket to me. This is the shrine of Anubis. What are you doing in my attic? Reverse. What are you doing in my attic? Forward. What are you doing in my attic? I live here. <laughs> The pharaoh was laid to rest here. Why is it in my attic? Reverse. Why is it in my attic? Since the pharaoh was laid to rest here. Since when? I live here. <laughs> this is the front. Looks like a good cast. <laughs> Mr. Lamb, hey, I got going? something I want to show you. Hey, going? Forward. I got hey. something I want to show you. Mr. Lamb. <laughs> Looks like a uh, casket. This is the shrine of Anubis. What are you doing in my attic? I live here. Since when? Since the pharaoh was laid to rest well, here. Why is he here? Well, he's my tell brother. <laughs> I yes. see the resemblance. Reverse. Yes. I see the resemblance. He's my brother. Well, I couldn't tell you. Why? I live here. <laughs> Wait, since the barrel was. <laughs> The pharaoh was laid to rest here. But well, why is it in my attic? This is my brother. I don't know. <laughs> I see the resemblance. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> you got problems with the foundation and, uh, and the casket. Yeah. And the casket. You got problems with the foundation. He's my brother. Yes. <laughs> I live <laughs> Mr. Lamb, I got something I want to show you. Hey, what's going on, Marty? Oh, boy, he's not gonna like this. I've never seen a casket that long since 1812. Do you want to do something crazy? Give me a location. Give me a location. Give me some 
wants to go on vacation. occupation is a lion trainer. My location is the Statue of Liberty, and my weapon is a red cardboard box. Okay, all right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our first detective in here, and then our, our, uh, our uh, person who's seen that they're cheating is gonna come back as well, walk through it, and they're gonna kill Alex, maybe, and then we're gonna have to, say, they're gonna have to say it to the next person. So whatever Alex gets into guess is what we're gonna have to do. So, on the count of three, we're going to say, hey, detective, all right? One, two, three. Okay, 
Ya. Ya.
Flop, flop. Dadah. Flop. Oh. Red cardboard box from Amazon? Yes! Yeah. 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 